company Glencore, which has its, international, its uh, initial public offering in Hong Kong today. And uh, this company, with 500 elite traders, is a major source of instability, of hunger, of hardship for the poor around the world. The Asian Development Bank recently warned that 64 million people around the world this year risk being pushed into absolute poverty, extreme poverty because of rising food prices. Everyone knows about the rising food prices in Hong Kong. Around the world now, inflation is triggering revolts from Egypt, Tunisia, throughout the Middle East and North Africa, and in many other parts of the world. And Glencore, that will be listed on the stock market today, is a major cause of this instability because it speculates in commodities such as wheat. And the power that these financial speculators have is awesome. And we say that it should be under public and democratic control. Not for the banks, not for the stock markets, not for the speculators, but under the democratic control of ordinary working people. Last year, when Russia was experiencing its worst ever drought, the wheat price increased by 15% in a matter of days. And one of the reasons was that Glencore, the company that will be listed on the Hong Kong Stock Exchange today, they called the Russian Prime Minister, so powerful is this company, so good are their contacts, and they said to the Russian Prime Minister, why don't you ban wheat exports because of the drought in Russia? And that's exactly what the Russian government did within a matter of days. And Glencore made millions in profit overnight from rising food prices, which hammered working people and poor people all around the world. And that's why we say that this company, Glencore, it shows the evils of capitalism. It shows the evils of an economy and a society which is run in the interests of a tiny handful of billionaire speculators while ordinary people go hungry, while poor people around the world face extreme poverty or starvation in the course of 2011. We warn also the people who are thinking of buying into this IPR. A Glencore is a bubble. Commodity prices like oil, like food commodities, like other energy, like metals, they're inflated at the moment in global terms because of the China economic boom which is sucking in raw materials like copper, like zinc, which also Glencore has the dominant position in world markets. It's a global bubble and commodity prices are already heading downwards and they could crash in the course of the next one or two years and therefore the only people who will get rich from Glencore's IPO are the tiny handful of speculators and the directors of Glencore itself. The CEO of Glencore, Mr. Ivan Glasenberg, he's expected overnight, by tomorrow morning, he will be a multi-billionaire. He will personally be worth around 12 billion US dollars as a result of this IPO. So, in 24 hours time, he will be one of the richest men in Europe. The company Glencore is based in Switzerland. But we don't think that the other people, the small shareholders who buy into Glencore, will have such a happy story. Because it is a commodity bubble and it's going to burst. So we say, make a stand for the poor of the world who are facing hunger, who are facing terrible increases in food prices. Show your opposition to what is the absolutely rotten and evil face of capitalism which speculates in global hunger and in misery. Show your opposition to Glencore today. Thank you.